Well, well. Looks like fortune favors the stupid, too. Now what? I'm gonna ask for a refund. Thank you. Ask for I don't even see the job on the map anymore. Front Stefan, that's what I need. Of course. All right, Steph. here we go. It'll be real awkward of a conversation. A refund. Oh, holy shit, girl! Y you good? Hey, after you booted up that bird, you, you started glitching out and. Save your breath. You conned me. You knew what you were doing. You want to know what I do, though? Hmm? Mm -hmm. Now hold up, yo. Let's mm -hmm. all be chill for a second. You've got an hour to get out of Night City and never look back. Oh, oh, my sweet fucking Jesus. Thank you. I knew you could- Shut the fuck up. I wasn't finished. If I ever see your face again, I'll gut you and string you up by your insides. Understand? Now start walking. Man, even she was afraid. All right, go again. <sighs> At least I got a got an ending to that. They didn't give me an objective. Wait, oh, all right. Here we go. Uh, unlock crafting specs for legendary quick hacks. This is what I've been waiting for. What do we got? What did my uh, thing say again? Ultimate quick hack read once. Alright, so crafting. Got uh, legendary contagion, legendary cripple movements, legendary cyber psychosis. Passive. Enemies under the effect of any quick hack will no longer try to avoid inflicting friendly fire. While equipped with no other allies. By target will commit suicide. Uh, sets the status of drones, mechs, and robots to friendly. Oh. Passive. Uh, while equipped, defeating an enemy with any explosive reduces the RAM cost of your next ultimate hack by two. Sack up the. F yeah, there's passives to all these. Suicide causes an enemy to limit a cooldown. Uh, Sonic Shock. Shock passive while equipped critical hits of any weapon will apply this quick hack tier one effect. Jeez. Let's see. Burns last longer. Targets affected by from burning burn uh 
Targets affected by a burn from overheat are unable to use Cyborg ability. Passive. Wall equipped it. Defeating any enemy with a quick hit causes nearby enemies to panic. There is a legendary ping. Passive all equipped all quick acts capable of spreading to multiple targets can jump one additional time. Right. Huh. So let's go ahead and equip all these. I didn't get get a whistle. Go to cyberpsychosis. Uh, yep. Cyberpsychosis. Shock. King. You can only have one at a time. Burn. Inventory. While equipped, unlocks the optics jammer daemon for you. The breach protocol. Oh. oh man. Getting all the. Getting all the nice. What's burn do again? Targets affected by burn. Cyberware. Form act. That's nice. This is really. Nice. I didn't realize that it. It's the status of drones, mechs, and robots friendly. That's a new. One equipped it. What were the other ones? That was back to crafting. Legendary quick hack. Contagation. We'll equip it all quick hacks capable of spraying multiple targets. Jump one more. So I guess this would be considered three. Subsequent target gains more contagation. All enemies in the effect of any quick hat cannot sprint. While equipped, defeating any enemy with any explosion reduces the ram cost of the next ult check by four. Uh, no pass up on Sonic Shock. This one, though, this causes. Causes an enemy to wall equipped it, cause uh, well, passive wall equipped it, causing an enemy to panic. I'm caught. Uh, deafening an enemy with any quick hack that causes near my enemies to panic. Hmm. This just deals damage, but I can use. Deals more damage based on how much the target's already missing. If the target is defeated by this quick hack, they burst into flames, cause enemies nearby to panic. That's neat. Uh, system reset. That's also another 
minute one. That's an ultimate attack. Ultimate attack. Yeah, all right, I think I got what I... <gasps> oh, and it's not armor mod. All right. That was worth one. Uh, let's go ahead and finally do automatic load. Since we've been sitting on this for a while, and I've been wanting to know how it goes. It's really close. Once again, we offer you a humble thanks. You saved a great many lives. Least I can do. What's the plan now? Can oh. your brother still be a monk? Though my path is paved with ever greater challenges, I shall not give up. Uh, humor me for a sec. If you don't look too kindly on having implants, then what do you think about constructs? Ah, yes. You mean the relic. A fashionable subject, is it not? It is a complex, fluctuating affair. It all depends on whether the engram is a copy of a person, or if this person merely exists in a digital realm. Let's say an engram's just a person that's been digitized. Is that kosher, in your view? Buddhism does not condemn digitization per se. Vending machine often preach in temples. No, I would not condemn the simple act of transfer, under the condition that they are at peace with it. One must still remember that they will still be imprisoned in their body, even if their body is not flesh. Immortality isn't your thing. I'm guessing. He who cannot die cannot be born into a better life. And will never achieve nirvana. So, sorry about these monks. Uh, this monk came to me because his brother was kidnapped. And that crazy gang that, you know, they take out like the front half of their head. Yeah, those people. They decided it'd be fun to augment this monk. Fun, because they don't believe in augmentation. Pretty much Let's say up. the Ingram's just a copy. But then, could you say that person was real? If they are truly self-aware, a Buddhist will recognize them as a human being. A perfect copy of a complex human mind is still a human mind. But is it capable of reincarnation? And if it's not, can it still be regarded as a being in possession of a soul? What you're saying, in other words, is... It's complicated. Suffering is key. He has been there since the dawn of human existence. If a construct can suffer, it is a person. Let's take Johnny. What's your take, Johnny? You just you, or a copy? What difference does it make? You heard him. I'm trapped in a few lines of code, and your body. Maybe Johnny Silverhand really is dead? Why isn't Maybe his hand silver? Well, what imitation? That what you wanted to say? That texture. If the problem. real Johnny Silverhand's dead, then that's his problem, not mine. You don't say. Feel a headache coming on just thinking about it. Good luck. Well then, I wish you all the best of luck. Farewell. And do not stray from the path of righteousness. I feel bad for this guy though. They they also they did not do a pretty job on the hogs that they forced on him. They mostly did it for fun. They did it to be sadistic. They did it to make it look like And they did it. Mr. Stein. Alright. Let's go to automatic. Easy level. Let me play. You can watch. Take the elevator to the clouds. 
Way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. Thanks, Johnny. Thanks for that. What have I missed this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Arasaka and the tiger claws are in bed together. Go figure. Every corp plays dirty. Except the streets are more than that. They're filth. So the corpse leave it to the gang. Suits collars and gets soiled. Surprised? That's all this is So hold on. You take a blow up doll, remodel the hole, and, and that's cheating. That's the infidelity. Uh, no. What? Well, did I walk in? How's you? that any different from some dollhouse ass? Because the ass is meat, not latex. That's so hard to understand. Meat, right. No feeling going on, no thinking, no awareness. It's empty. Might as well be latex. Masturbation, sophisticated kind. That's all it is. Whoa, fuck. Makes perfect sense, that. Just a normal conversation. Talk about how people who hire themselves out to be dolls are real people. They don't retain their memories of it. They just act like an actual doll is disturbing, to say the least. Uh, yeah, they're still there. This is Renji. Huh. Ooh. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? You realize personal links aren't secure, right? Could get hit with malware straight to my core, into paying an arm and a leg for a ripper dock. We need data from your core to pair you up with the doll. Meaning a biometric scan? Just that. If anything goes wrong, you can lodge a complaint. But that's never happened. So how's this all work? An algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into... experiences in real time. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting. Well, I could say yes, but that would strip it of mystery and suspense, wouldn't it? Once you're in there, you set the stakes. You're saying it's not dangerous, but there's some risk involved. That is one way to put it. One thing is for sure. You never get what you expect. Consider my interest peaked. This is like the other brain dance I had. How could you possibly know what I'm looking for? Clouds always knows. Your deepest desire, we find it. You'll have your needs fulfilled. And maybe much more. Less is not a word we use around here. Looking for an Evelyn Parker. She work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look real just time. as you wish. Uh, I just want to I talk just to her. want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Jack in, please. Huh. I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning? 
Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. All right. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Uh. Hmm. Samurai. 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 And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Oh. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Two matches. Interesting. Is that normal or? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? Is it because Johnny's here? Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. That it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. I like this rule. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Clouds Go is one of the dip, safest Johnny. places in all of Night City. Ah. <laughs> uh, all right. Thank you. We hope you enjoy your stay. All right, real quick, I'm gonna save. Yeah, it's here. Look, Rick. Just to double check, I can craft another gun if I really need it. The next one. 